So I'm a biomedical engineer and we're using the technique of 3D printing to revolutionise the area of medical devices. So 3D printing is revolutionising every industry in the world at the moment. They're printing catwalk fashion in Milan, they're printing houses in China. And we're using 3D printing technology to apply it to a medical problem. So my research, the research at QUT, is looking at ways to create patient-specific solutions for adults and children who are suffering tissue loss. This may be the result of a cancer excision, a traumatic fracture where someone may have broken the leg and a segment of their bone is missing, or also potentially from congenital birth defects. For example, microtia, where the outer part of the ear has not formed properly. So we're coming up with innovative solutions, new biomaterials, new manufacturing techniques to create patient-specific implants for these children, for these adults. And really, the, the future of the Australian economy depends very heavily on revolutionising our manufacturing area. It also is so important that we focus on the healthcare needs of the generations of, 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 our, of our children and to create jobs for them. So as we move into the future in Australia, the population's getting older and older, and also incidence of diabetes and also obesity is increasing. So this leads to situations where we may have more fractures as we grow older, osteoporosis is more prevalent. So we really need to have specific solutions to treat these patients. But the only way that we can progress our ideas to the market, to the economy, to, to progress Australia into the future is to collaborate. And that's to work with industry, it's to work with local charities, because we can learn from them about how to do business and they can learn from us with our research ideas. And then we can progress into the future.